Oh my god. <laughs> We've been so worried. Guys, chill. I was just at a party and things were fine until we started getting a little crazy. But I still had a really good time. What do you mean got a little crazy? Well, things started out normal until the Quisha got out the alcohol. <sighs> Allie, Paul and I have decided that you have a serious problem. Yeah, you've been partying. Sam! Pill popping you've been doing. Totally fine. I'm young and I went to party. What's so wrong with that? Allie! What are those? Are those perks? Oh, no. In your start we is pleasure, boom she pleasure. Do you have any idea how bad these are for you? Well, they make me feel good. That's all that matters, right? Oh, hey. What are you guys doing? Allie, we're here to discuss your Percocet problem. Oh, and, and who is this? This is my draw, I mean, on a... Do you realize you're not only hurting yourself, but everyone that cares about you too? Yeah, you need to stop. Are we seriously gonna have an intervention? <gasps> am I gonna be on NZV? I honestly don't see what the big deal is. Name some facts or something. Gladly. Did you know that Percocet is just as bad as doing heroin or morphine, and that at least 1.9 million people in the U.S. suffer from Percocet addiction? Well, that explains a lot. But, people used to relieve pain, so why is it so bad for you? Well, first of all, you don't need it because you're addicted. Do you know that 16 million Americans report using prescription drugs like Percocet for non-medical use in the past year? Well, I'm not addicted to Roxy's. Roxy's? Really? Yeah, there's all kinds of names for it, like Perks, Polos, Roxy, Cotton Blue, Dynamite, and 152s. Oh wait, maybe I do need help. Don't worry, I have a number you can call. You should take one too. Thanks guys, it means a lot that you care so much. Alright, so we did prescription drugs, and the drug we chose was... Percocets. Alright, so uh, Percocets are normally used to relieve moderate to severe pain. Uh, the main ingredient is oxycodone. And the drugs are obtained from the street from numerous sources who go to many doctors with fake symptoms to get the drug known as farming. Um, some like symptoms and warnings of people using the drugs are if they're confused, they're sleepy, they're lightheaded, they have slow breathing, they sweat, they have headaches, vomiting, and dry mouth. Uh, warning, no, no, no. Um, it's made in the pharmacies. What? Oh, it's man made in the pharmacies. Um, um you're phys physically sluggish or slow, you're emotionally non caring. <laughs> You're socially, you don't want to interact so you can sleep, and you're mentally always lost or confused. And there is a number you can call if you have a problem, which is 866-872-6492. And that's the actual Percocet helpline. Yeah. So call it if you have an issue. Don't do drugs. They're really not good for you. Nope. <laughs> I'm so happy. Oh, Do you realize you're not only hurting yourself?
itself, but you're it. what? <laughs> Do you realize not? <laughs> Did you just and that at least 1.9 million? <laughs> Roxy is. Suck it in. 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 Suck it